We would never have imagined that we would actually find one. Uh, the last time uh, this particular species, the North Pacific right whale, was was sighted off the British Columbia coast was in 1951, so 62 years ago. And the population is extremely small in the north, in the eastern North Pacific. So the best estimate is that there's under 50 individuals alive today, wow. and that's between sort of Mexico and and the Bering Sea on the eastern half of the North Pacific. So uh, they're, they're critically endangered and, and extremely rare. Well, this is back in the 1800s, and they were, the baleen was, pro, was primarily what they were after, the whale bone, which is the, it's not really bone, it's the baleen plates that hang from the roof of the mouth, and they, they are up to three meters long. And these are the filtering structures that in, the, in the whale's mouth that they use to strain out the tiny little copepods, the zooplankton that they feed on. This was like a, kind of like spring steel back in those days. It was used for all sorts of things. Uh, but they also used the blubber uh, as a source of oil because they're very rich in blubber. They were called right whales because they were the right whales to hunt in that they were large, slow, and floated when they were killed. And so they were these waders in the 1800s were out in sailing ships and rowboats deployed from the sailing ships out on the high seas. So it's hard to imagine how they could have uh, wiped out, uh, you know, they killed over 30,000 of these whales in one decade.